Hi guys, I'm CL Creech, and this is my vlog series where I take a look at my past to help figure out my future. Welcome to Rediscovering Me. We are recording. Oh, this. You're recording. This recording out. All right, what's up, guys? So this week I'm gonna do something we never did. Back here with us. Turn around, turn it around. And we're here at Tabby's, and we're going to try to make taffy. What's taffy? Taffy with taffy. And so, a puss. This is her kitchen, so I'm gonna make her do the majority of the work while I do the recipe. <laughs> you really didn't see this coming. I mean, honestly. I didn't see honestly. It. I did not see it coming that I had to do, like you know, the work. <laughs> I got the puss on camera as well. All right. We need a large pot. As redneck as you can get and allow me to do it. All right. Do it. So go ahead and push that. Do you have measuring cups? Yes, I do. Alright. Uh, Good! Because I didn't think you'd get any. I didn't get the candy thermometer. I'll leave the water. I wasn't sure if you had one of those. No, I definitely do not have so a candy thermometer. Good deal. Okay, show the viewers what we have here. Okay, so we have I love salt. We have baking vanilla. We have the uh, okay. candy thermometer. The orange flavoring. Uh, flavoring that goes into it. We have black corn syrup. Now this is for, this is for a egg cream that yeah. we'll do in the soup. Oh, the milk needs to be in the fridge. Put in the freezer because it needs we to be We have cold. sugar. We have sweet cream butter, unsalted. We have food coloring, and we have uh, cornstarch. All right. So we need to add sugar to a large pot fitted with a candy thermometer. So okay, but how much sugar? Uh, <laughs> one cup. One cup, okay. So will you do that and I will fit the candy thermometer and hopefully not screw it up. Dear God, you know we're going to screw this shit up. Oh, I know I will because I am not good at this stuff. I've never made candy. I'm good at making like peanut butter fudge and chocolate fudge, stuff like that, but I have never made candy. Wow. Um, that's not going to, oh, well, it kind of sticks. There we go. Oh, okay. You got this stuff. You have an audience. Hi. Have a kitty cat audience. Alright, so one cup. That's all this video is going to yeah. be is the cat. Yes. Good. Yes, I do. Jim finally got me one. Uh, well, he found it and he was like, hey, do you need this? I was like, yes, yes, I do. Temperature guidelines. If I didn't have one, I don't know what I'd do because I used to use it for like dirt. <laughs> <laughs> Back as a kid. There's a guideline for jelly, and then fish underneath. I wonder if you'd like go in the middle if it'd be jellyfish. <laughs> you go in the middle and be like, yes, we can make jellyfish. Yeah, why not? All right. So you saw it here first, folks. The first person sugar? to find him funny. What? Oh no, I didn't. I didn't know. No, you, you didn't need to. Sift the sugar. You didn't say that we needed to sift the sugar. All right, sugar. we need to sift the cornstarch. I just sift want to mess with you. Let's see if I can find this thing. I'm being honest with you, I have not organized anything at all. All of my stuff is just all over the place. All over the place. Okay. Look at this cute <laughs> setup she's got going on here. Okay, so now. Alright. We're going to sift in some cornstarch. How much? Okay, so you want me to go ahead and do the sifting for the... No, not the sugar. I was joking no. about the sugar. Okay, I was about to say, I was like, I didn't know I had to do that. A tablespoon of cornstarch. Can I step in and grab my water? Yeah, keep recording. Okay. Uh, tablespoon? Hi, that's Jim. <laughs> He's smart and staying away from this bullshit. Who cares? I came here. Okay. No, that came straight from Walmart. So, table on my chair. <laughs> so. No, not so. I need a place to rest my precious but A tablespoon. If I can find it. This is what happens when you work with Chris in the kitchen. <laughs> Just throw cornstarch in your hair. And in hey, your ear. You know and what? In your bobby pin. Cornstarch is actually good for greasy hair. Yeah. Poison no joke. Her really face does. on her fingers when she's talking. Cornstarch is Quit really recording good her boobs. You can record mine. It's family friendly show. Right. Family friendly. So, one tablespoon of cornstarch. 
I don't have much boob at all, honestly. Like what up? There you go. I'll set that in. Alright. Now whisk. Or whisk. Maybe let her get it sifted in first. Yeah. Now whisk. Whisk. Right in behind here. You can tell I do a lot of baking when I don't have the, uh, when I have the money to do it. I don't do much baking. I do a lot of cooking. Not much baking. When I have the money and the food stamps, yes. I, I will refer to food stamps. But I'm talking or whisking, come on. But, uh, I like to bake, so hopefully right. this comes out right. Now we need to, is it welcome bond? Yes. Close enough. All right. How do you uh, know what will combine look? This is going to be a hell of a video. <laughs> it is. <laughs> now we need to add butter. Unsalted butter. And that's going to be a tablespoon. Hopefully these have the measurements. Yes, they do. Do they? Yeah. So cut us off a tablespoon. Ha! <laughs> Hi. That's cheating, no. <laughs> that's not cheating. That's engineering at its finest. <laughs> <laughs> it's engineering at its finest. One tablespoon. That does get a really good view of what's going on down there, though. So it's it really steady. does. Alright, drop it in. Alright. Corn syrup. So we need two thirds of a cup of light corn syrup. I'm glad she knows what. Yeah, it's, really, it's really getting a good view from right here. Two-thirds, but... Ah! It's my show, damn it. Yeah, you just got your nipples flat. <laughs> it's my show, damn it. All right, you two get yours at the smack next. Come here. I'm good. You took community guidelines, sorry. <laughs> it's fine for people to see your this nipples. This is off the record. It's not fine for people to see our nipples on YouTube. This is not a health-related thing. This is off the record. Nope. I love this stuff in general. All right, so two-thirds to go. I like it with anything, like... Butter, toast. Freaking. Oh no, that is two thirds of a cup, right? Two thirds of a cup. Oh, shit. Is there two? Or. Is there a spatula? I don't know if there is. There is some There might be one for your legs. <laughs> wow, again, community guidelines. <laughs> hey, community guidelines when there's a drawer in between my best friend's legs. I mean, come on. It's like an inside out kangaroo pouch. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's a vagina pouch. I'm gonna try to make Family sure. show, family show. This is a family show. My I used my belly as a pouch. I actually broke my glasses that way, broke my phone that way. Like where I got the mommy belly from where I had two kids, I actually put my stuff in my belly fat when I sit down. So underneath my belly it'd be like a whole array of like different shit. <laughs> So I would be sitting there just nonchalant, just putting my phone underneath there, get up, and my phone just be shattering all over the floor, like, oh, I forgot what was there. Oh. Well, <laughs> if we get the salt that? open, we're going to do salt things. You've already got open salt. Well, damn it. All right, I need a teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon. Longer, and you've got all the... Bitch. cream to make after this. Alright. There we go. Water. How much? Half a cup. Alright. We're not using coconut water. It's not coconut water. It's normal. I it's like. regular water. Oh, by the way. We don't do endorsements. Okay. No target pay you anymore. Say when. There you go. Okay. Half a cup of water. Next will be the no. <laughs> a teaspoon of vanilla extract. 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 That really is getting a great view. Yeah. I mean, it's right on the pot. Teaspoon. So was I when I was in the bathroom. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Needs help? Or a toothpick? Slightly used. I've got stiletto nails that'll punch your skin. I do not. Oh, I got it in my mouth anyway. Up. Oh. <laughs> not in your mouth. In the pot. Big us a teaspoon. Well, this show just took a turn. Alright. 
you know, vanilla extract smells so good, but it tastes like absolute war. It just tastes so horrible. Right, we never man. promise we're professionals. No, we're yeah. not professionals at all. Alright, now you're about to turn it over. Orange extract. Okay, we rinse. Alright, so do a half a teaspoon of that. Okay. That is orange flavoring because for some reason we are doing orange. Elevated between that one, rum, and peppermint. Hey, you know what? Probably peppermint would have been the best choice. Probably would have. I don't know. I, think, I was thinking the rum, honestly. Especially where it's going to have the vanilla in it. Well, yeah, that I does told make you to a pick, and you said you didn't care, so I just threw one down. That makes quite a bit of sense, honestly, because like with the rum and the vanilla, it probably would taste the hell a lot better. I don't know how this is going to taste better. We're going to try, though. Maybe like orange cream? Uh, well, hey, yeah, actually, I didn't think about that. So, so half a teaspoon of that. Alright. Yeah, that's perfect. It smells really good. Now, whiskey. Whiskey good. Whiskey. Whiskey good. I got to put it back on this. It smells like alcohol. It smells like triple sec. Oh, uh, yeah, it's got alcohol in it. Whiskey. No, not whiskey. Wait, well, you're getting butter whiskey. Or whiskey. Do you even have that turned on so the butter will start melting? To make it easier to whisk? No, we're going to turn it. Leave the thermometer in there! I can't. So she can whisk. So there's not an obstacle in feeding her since you're not doing any of this. I am. <laughs> He's telling me what to do! He's delegating. When am I going to get my sock for this? Sock. Dobby needs her sock. I'm saying I'm Pop culture but, references! But Master, I need my sock to be free. I need an article of clothing. Okay, tell me, baby. I need an article of clothing. Oh, this butter is stuck inside the bed. <laughs> oh, it is caged. Okay, no, it ain't no more. I thought we had cage-free butter. It's slave <laughs> butter. No, it is it is not cage-free. I'm sorry, that just it see look, it just does not want to uh just leave it in there, it'll okay. melt in a minute. Alright. Pop that back on. Alright. We're about to turn some heat on anyway. Alright, well I'll go ahead and I'll clean off the uh, stove. Yeah, we do not want to set fire. No, we do not need a fire. Right, this fire apartment is expensive enough as it is. Medium heat. We want to make sure we get the security deposit back. <laughs> yeah, for real though. I would love to be able to get my security deposit, uh, deposit back because I need the money for like a better place. A way better place. Where my bathroom does not have a door that smacks the toilet. That <laughs> that would be ideal. <laughs> if I had a bathroom with a door. Oh, turn the right one on, right? <laughs> yes, that's uh, one requirement. Good bathroom ventilation. Oh god, yeah, especially where I dye my hair a lot. That's right. really being needed. The rest of the apartment can be shit. Good While bathroom we're doing ventilation. This, Debbie, I need a greased, heat proof dish. Cake pan. Or cookie shit. Heat sheet. proof, because it's gonna be hot as hell. Am I out of the way? I'm not exactly contributing here. I did not even think That'd be perfect. You can use butter to grease it. Yeah. Just get a stick of butter and just go. Just slather the shit on there. We gotta pay attention to the temperature here. Well, you pay attention to the temperature. She's doing all your other shit for you. Alright, now we're gonna turn the heat on. Directing. Oh my gosh, she burped. She burped. She burped. Okay, salt. Tabby, back up. Oh, what is it? Oh, orange. <laughs> She's I killing can get her me. better than that. Don't oh, don't do, do it. it. Don't that do shit it. was not cheap. Stop it. Put it back. No. Oh my god. Cornstarch is not cheap at all. Somebody said yeah, that other way. I figured because we don't really use cornstarch, just want to keep it. If you want oh, to. cool. Hey, whatever you want me to keep here, I'm definitely going to be using it. So. We'll it come back up next week anyway. So. Ain't like we don't come up here once a week anyway. Maybe I can make my peanut butter fudge. Oh yeah, you come back up. I can definitely I need, help you. Uh, just a jar of peanut butter, powder, and sugar. Uh, well, my jar of peanut butter is somewhere out here. There you go. There's a jar of peanut butter over there. He, oh, no, that's happening. See? That's my peanut butter. It's just peanut Long butter and powdered sugar. The worst ever so often. I cheat. Yeah. I wanted to get to about 250 degrees. No, what's the I want to see if I can get this butter to melt down this little bit. It's where it's a thick pot. It's going to take a little bit. Hey, you know what? This is already starting to smell really good. Be careful, I forgot to get masks. Be careful really? of the inhaling and stuff. Hey, if I... Lungs. If that's how you go out, that's how you go out. 
you know what? Something's gonna kill me one of these days. My pancreas, my kidney, I don't care which one. It's gonna happen. Yes, but this is not your pancreas. Your kidney. Oh! This won't instantly kill you. You will suffer, and I don't want my friends to suffer. I don't want you to suffer, Patty. Chris is on his own. I already suffer enough. <laughs> I already suffer enough. Sadness. It's one of those, you know, how Spongebob had locked himself in his house, and how he sat there and said, I'm a... What was that? He doesn't need to eat. He only does air. So he went... <laughs> That's me. <laughs> As I suffer enough, I only need air. <laughs> Don't stir too much. Make sure you give it time to heat. God, it really does smell good, though. That vanilla and that orange completely come together, like, awesomely. Chris, you're in the way. Do you want yellow? Do you want orange? Like... Dude, okay. you got yeah, I red. Yeah, red and yellow. Do you want to add it now? No, not yet. We want no. to add it. No, okay. Like Unless you want, what, two drops of yellow and a drop of red to make orange? I'm not really sure. You want to, you want to at least have it on the right yet. Oh, it don't. No, so the thing is Remember the, your color will form class. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, but let me speak. That's my code. Drop. Don't forget that. <laughs> but essentially, if we put it in too early because food color has water in it, Oh. It'll water it down, whereas if we wait till it gets to the temperature, it'll blow the water out. Okay. I know that. It blow the water much. out. The more you know with Reading Rainbow. Lofty Pursuits on YouTube, if you guys ever do a crossover guy. episode. Not, not Black Science Guy, but. Oh. Lofty Pursuits is. Kind of we were talking know. about the Reading Rainbow Guy. Oh, oh, yeah. Jordy LaForge. Yeah, Jordy LaForge. It's who we were you talking know how, about. You know how I. Like, hey, Go get my medal. <laughs> You know how they give like that whole entire like knowledge thing and it says the more you know with the rainbow and the star at the end of it? I always reference back to that. So we're at about half the temperature we need right now. But yeah, you want two to red, yellow to or two to one yellow to red. Remember your color well folks. Art class was the one class I was good at. Art class was the one class that I failed at. And I did not know how to Arts, Humanities, English. I did. As long as it wasn't science it. or math, I was good at it. I did not know how to draw, so I drew stick figures and like flip books. <laughs> just doing stupid stuff. I had one doing like the humping motion and stuff like that. I did I did this really <laughs> nice one of Trent Reznor in school for Ronnie Chills. Who? Trent Reznor. Singer Ronnie Chills. Oh! Trent Reznor. Again, potential crossover episode. Future With Trent you. Reznor, special guest, ta-da-da. We're at about 150 degrees right now. We know about, how to make that you, happen. You hit about 250. Once it hits 250, we're going to add the food coloring, pull it off the heat, pour it onto the baking sheet. All right. We need to line the baking sheet with the, uh, parchment. the paper. No, parchment paper is used for... Uh, oh, to wrap it. Yep. Yeah. So you just need to take the butter to the parchment to the thing. I'll do that. that. Yeah, because he's Go getting ahead. a freaking slave driver here. I got you, darling. I'll smell that. God, that smells so good. Now, I have, I have made in the past, I have made a um, candy coating for apples. But Ooh. that was totally different than making taffy. This is salt water taffy. Yeah, it's totally different. For the record, salt. guys, we are using the Tasty app for the recipe, so... Tasty, if you're paying attention to getting crossover, <laughs> trying to get viewers and subscribers here. Next time with Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> We're doing, we'll, we'll call this a monthly segment called uh, Taffy with Tabby. Taffy with Tabby. I like that. That's good. Well, at least it's better than the uh, It's better than that. What was that? No, there was something. It was Aqua, 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 aqua Ass Lizard. That's a D&D &D reference. I'll fill yeah. you guys in, like, in my post-show comments. Long story short, it's thanks to a half-orc. It's thanks to a half-orc. He messed me up, and the next thing I know, boom, I'm an Ass Lizard. I'm called Ass Lizard, so... Technically, it's thanks to the DM that got me poisoned. Yeah. So, no, it's not thanks to the orc. It's thanks to the DM. Well, he well, knows. Yeah. Well, if he wouldn't have ate it, I wouldn't have had a problem with that. If if he would have, if our DM would have had the sense to let me get up and still have my clothes on, <laughs> I would have been an ass lizard to begin with. Would it? No, I would not have had a. Wait a minute. Where, when was it the lesbian orc came into play? It first. was in the beginning. Okay. It was, like first. it was in the beginning. She stomped me into the ground because I'm she. Uh, yeah, I'm lightly greased. Lightly greased. Oh. Hey, looks good. It's lightly greased. 
Like my hair. <laughs> Right, so we're uh, 175, a little higher, looks like. No, we're higher. almost at 200, exactly. Whiskey. Whiskey good. Name that band. Devo. Oh, thank Whiskey. God. What is that cat doing? Speaking of which, She's getting coming caught. after the first of the year, I'm doing a music video parody of Whippet. It's called Grip It. Grip <laughs> It. I'm not kidding. I've already got the lyrics, so I'm just going to get it recorded. Beck's directing. Grip It. Good. There's gonna be a lot of peanuts. Yeah, it's actually, gonna be a yeah. sea of peanuts. I've already got like a whole slew of volunteers for the music video. A wilderness of willies. Cool. A wilderness of willies. Yes. And wild camps. Yes. So yeah, since this is the episode that gets me banned from YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I was not saying YouTube. I want to <laughs> thank everybody for tuning in. This will be. I can't remember which episode or which week this will be. It doesn't be. matter, it'll be the last one. I think this will be a week. This is the this episode is the episode before Thanksgiving week. I know that. Because I won't be here. I will actually be up at my daughter's house for that Thanksgiving week, so No, this will be the week before Thanksgiving is when this episode comes out. Oh well. I mean I might be up there a little bit longer because Thanksgiving my mom usually has me doing all of the cooking. All of the baking, all of the pies. You want to see my ass order every pizzas? My ass be working Thanksgiving, pizzas. so. You have pizzas for Thanksgiving? We did one year, didn't Hey, you know what? I would like to have a turkey and ham pizza. Just straight up turkey and ham. That would be awesome. All of our family is like dispersed, so I I'm not a really good I'm probably working Thanksgiving, so. Well, see, my family, my mama actually moved up to London, Kentucky recently and she has never so we're above 200 now she has never left harlan that long in her older years tilt the pan this way please just give it a little there we go okay good perfect get your oh God, get your head good. out of there it does it really but smells super no good. with for many holidays i'm really non-traditionalist i don't care as long as i at least get to talk to someone from in the family i, I don't care if we eat pizza burgers or a traditional meal or anything i am very traditional i used to be but you know, that's when you were little, and... It's gotten to the point now where, like, Christmas and Halloween, where I am so into Halloween, I can honestly care less if Christmas is Christmas, as long as my little girl gets her presents and she knows that Santa Claus brought them. Agreed. My Christmas tree, okay? Halloween theme, and I could care less. We're gonna it get a shot best. of that real quick. It is the best. Look at, look at this shit. Look how amazing that is. I gotta get more ornaments for it. Look at that. If I could find purple ones, I'd be great. How did you guys take over my show? <laughs> How did you let it happen? <laughs> is a better question. All right. Is it about time for us oh. to go ahead and put that? Uh, two fifty. It's two fifty. It is uh, two ten or two twenty. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let us see i think no, two ten. Is it five? Y'all move your heads. About two fifteen. Is it two seventeen? Okay. Well, so I don't have my glasses. I have no glasses. Who said right that? Now. Who said Jesus. that? Cat. Ow! Oh, she bit me! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't promise I didn't buy it. They call me Tabby Cat for a reason. I was about to say something that wouldn't have got me banned from YouTube. But... <laughs> you can say stuff, just don't do it. <laughs> that was the problem. I mean, what if I wanted to do it? Do it. Oh, speaking of. You know, Keep in mind we're being recorded. Jimmy, he has this thing, like, where you just said do it. He has this thing where he, like, tries to act like he's going to discipline the cat. And he'll go. Or he'll go. With that little finger. I don't understand it. I don't know where he got it from. I'm trying to stir up some of that white foam a little bit. Can you smell that vanilla? Or is it more orange? I think it's kind of a half and half. It smells like kind of an orange cream to me. It's a, actually, I have one left of the orange cream pickle in my fridge. It smells fridge. almost like an orange cream pickle to me. Hey, if it does come out like an orange cream pickle, what holy joke, this. I We've would. We've got enough. We can make a couple more bags. That would enough. be awesome. We'll do the first batch and then give See how it goes. If it goes good, then we can, again, I'll, we bought enough stuff that we can make more. It's almost at 250. About 225. Yeah. It's, it's, it's just that red line right there. It's the 250. It's halfway there. It's 225. Can I whisk? I, I want to participate. 
I want to be in it too. No, I really don't. <laughs> I don't want to do this. She's like, no, I really don't. I didn't ask for any of this. <laughs> Welcome to the Tabby and Becky cooking hour. It's a cooking power hour. We put Chris down here in the oven. Yeah, I mean, you know what? It, he didn't fit well. Oh, uh, no, we lied. He's back. He, yeah, well, well, I mean... We were about to say he didn't fit well because he has long legs and it wasn't a, you know. Dude, I'm what? Hat. You're right in the camera's way. Move. I shall. I will let this burn. I will. <laughs> I will ruin your taxi. I'll slow down the turn a little bit. I wanted to participate from it. Your moment is up. Yep. <laughs> Okay, we're sure. So we did we'll, not get gloves for this. No. No, we'll be alright. Tabby's gonna handle it anyway, so if anybody gets burned, it's on her. <laughs> I'll well, we got to stretch it for like fifteen minutes, so we'll take. Fifteen her. minutes. Have you never done taffy? Have you never seen them full taffy? It's no. a, it's a process. It, it is. It is not a. I have it's seen, not a thing you do, it is an entire process. I'm fairly I sure have it's seen cult. people make like the dragon's beard candy, mm -hmm. where it looks like cotton candy, but it's not really cotton candy. It looks like stringy yeah. taffy. Right here. This is what we'll be doing next. You want to show the camera? Oh. No, I don't want to show the camera. This is not my video. That's what we're going to be doing for about 10 to 15 minutes. Now, see, like in Gatlinburg at like Old Smokey's Candy Shop, it takes okay, two gals to do it. Alright, yeah, I can do that. We'll take turns on it, because I, mean, I do want to try it a little bit myself. I hope you scald yourself. Not heavy though. She's okay, cool. Then we'll roll it out. Like a dick. And cut it up. Like a dick. And then just use parchment paper to wrap it up. So okay. you're just making bite side. It's almost like making a... Laffy Taffy's. Laffy Taffy, yeah, Laffy Taffy. <laughs> it's going to be orange cream sickle Laffy Taffy, and that's going to be awesome as hell. I'll get out. And then just wrap it up in parchment paper. You want to cut us up some parchment paper back? When that's done, I'll do that part. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get my water for I hope you're okay with my butt being on your counter. Oh, I'm fine with Tabby it. Tabby has a really comfortable counter. You can, you're the only one that can fit on it. I can't even get up there. I was really worried. I was confused. <laughs> 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 huh? okay, it's, it's gotten slower now. It has. Turn right, the distance. You don't want to go ahead and put that in there right now, do you? No, not to. Not to turn your heat up a notch or two. Yeah, try it just a hair bit higher. We don't want to get there you go. too fast, though. We don't want it to end up scolding, because that would... It it might smell good. It'll taste awful. It be, Yeah, it would it taste awful. It might smell good, though, because, I mean... Or hey, you know what? I used to orange use, smells good. I used extract in my tart burners at one time. Because I had no tarts, and oh my god, I love the lavender extract stuff because it would make my house smell amazing. Those little game beads? Yes. And the Downy Unstoppable beads. I wouldn't do it often because they're expensive, they're five bucks a thing, but oh god, oh my god. I used to do that. I love tarts. I want to start doing it because I get tarts constantly. They're not expensive. I mean, they're like $2, but you get like, what is that, two, four, six? Yeah. Six it's, or eight. Yeah. Like, it's not very many, but that's still like. Two dollars a pop. I can't stand knowing that it only lasts for probably like Whereas give or take like, like an hour or two. The game. And we are back. Okay. From my space. Well, that went to like it only goes for like twenty some minutes, and we were like Don't twenty twenty five minutes. Man, in. Copyright! Copyright! Aren't you the one? Shut up! Copyright! They will pull you for that. Copyright. Copy I'll believe me if they're to get me for some of my let's plays. Whoops. Have you really been put yeah, you really have. I've watched your let's plays. Well, <laughs> was your YouTube channel fun while it lasted? <laughs> Alright, I blinded myself on the lot. Uh we are slightly above two thirty, almost to two thirty five looks like. We're getting a little bit of steam, which is good because it's burning off some of the water. Yeah, well, not only that, but, like, I had to make sure that it was getting off the side of the pan, because it would, if it wouldn't, it would actually stick, and it would not come out. Now, this is going to be sticky. This is what happens when you don't have oh, pants. Yeah. This tap. is what happens. It's supposed to be sticky, but it would not come out of the pan, and we don't want to waste any of this, because this, the, the ingredients for this stuff is not cheap no. at all. 
I think so we, we don't probably want to spend 30 bucks on this, every day. God. Well, see, the greasy cut pies that I make aren't very expensive. It's a chocolate uh, crust that you get, like the... Um, well, keep in mind, we spent like 30 bucks, but at the same time, we've got enough ingredients that we can do like two or three more batches. Yeah. yeah. So the hot. chocolate crust, the dark chocolate crust that you get from uh, Max, you get a big thing of peanut butter, like that. You get uh, a huge thing of whipped cream. Two of the packs of uh, that, two packs of uh, chocolate pudding, and Reese cups for ourselves. Almost two forty. And you take. I will get you the stuff to make me one of those. It's so good. You can keep all the ingredients. I just want one thing. The pans. You gotta make sure that it is frozen before you go doing anything because if not, the crust will crumble. It will break apart. Yeah. So you take whipped cream and peanut butter. And you get it mixed together really nice, but you gotta make it thin enough to where it doesn't, it, like it spreads nicely in pan. And then the second layer is the Reese cups. You break those up and you <laughs> crumble them on top of the peanut butter. So we're just above 240 right now. We are getting close, guys. The third part is the chocolate. So you take the chocolate pudding and the whipped cream and you put it together. Uh, you whip it up really good and then you put that as the top layer. And you even it out completely. Put it in the freezer for like an hour and then pop it out and it tastes just like a Reese cup. It is so good. I'm buying you the stuff to make them. Yes. Jim's obsessed with them. I've been making them since I was and like I'm trying to go low I'm trying to go no carb high. <laughs> I remember when I started making them, my daughter was about right, maybe 10, two years old. And she adored them. She adored them so much. Well I tell you, you killed the heat. Basically, we're just going to, as soon as it hits 250, we're going to take one. Gonna take one, and I'll take the other. We're going to put these in, whisk, and kill the heat. And you might want to pull the thermometer out to whisk that stuff. Yeah. We are at like 248 right now. Put it back down to medium. Yeah. When Remember, guys, two to one, yellow to red. Say about 10 seconds. We are at 250. Go ahead and cut it off. Yeah. So, which one do I have? I've got the You've red. You've got the red. Alright, there we go. You only put one drop in, right, Chris? It's like yeah. a drop and a half. Put uh, at least I a half drop more. Let's we'll stir this and we'll, we'll see the color. I want to try to get a good orange color to the. If we can. That looks a little bit more red. Let's throw a little bit more yellow in. Alright, there you oh, go. There we go. That's a nice orange. Do we gotta let it cool down a little bit or automatically put it in the pan? We're gonna put it in the pan and let it cool in the pan. Okay. We don't wanna let it cool too much though, right? Uh, no. And this okay. is how I lose my phone. Oh, uh, you probably do just a tad. Oh, no, I think no, that's the, yeah, perfect. Orange that's a perfect good. orange. Yeah. yeah, it's going to be really nice All and right. dark. So, too, we're going to. Oh, parts. set the food color over there. Uh, hand me the pan. We'll just set the pan right here. And we want to. Right, pour it into the salt. pan. You want to do the pour? Yeah. Where's my lid? There you go. Pour it in, let it get like flatten out. Oops. Just killed your dish towel. <laughs> it's okay. I saved the dish towel. It's gonna be a dark orange, but it's it's orange. It's really pretty though. It's like a rose orange. Get all okay. of that that you can. Come on, Tabby, don't skimp on it. I'm trying not to. You know what? Maybe we wanted to lick the pan afterwards. Yeah, that's 250 degrees. You go right ahead. That was the best part of making peanut butter fudge when I was little. My granny used to make it the old school way. All right. You're getting a wooden spoon. All right, so we, just want... okay. All right, so we just want to let this cool until we can handle it. So we're looking at five to ten minutes. So we'll go ahead and kill the recording now since the recording tried to kill itself a couple of minutes early. And we'll pick back up here in about ten minutes. See you guys in ten minutes. Standing. And light. There we go. <clears throat> there we go. All right. So Tabby is pulling the taffy. You're gonna have to do this ten to fifteen minutes. 
that's fine. It ain't even really that hot. It's it's warm enough to where it's still melty, but it's not like super hot. So that's the best part about it. At least I'm not burning my hands. Quit videoing the cat. But look, she's interested. She wants to know what's going on. Right, do you have any scissors we need to like, cut up some of that parchment? Like yeah. Where? They are in the living room. Oh, it's getting sticky on my hands. Scissors. If I would have thought a little bit of powdered sugar. Yeah. If I'd have thought about it, a little bit of powdered sugar for this um, part. Cornstarch. I might need a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Don't be a. I'm gonna be good. Oh, it's sticking to me. I think it's a little too late, Chris. There we go. Just a little bit of cornstarch. <sighs> just, yeah, just rub it into my hair. It might work. All right. Uh, what are we doing with parchment paper? Parchment paper is underneath all that stuff. It's in front of the microwave directly. Oh, I see it. Directly in front of the microwave. Oh. That make it easy? Just a little bit. Maybe a little bit more. Oh. I might have to take these rings off. They're sticky. Oh, they're all sticky. Yeah, we go put them in but the bathroom. Right. They'll be alright. I'll okay. get them clean. It's slowly becoming opaque. Very slowly, but it's getting there. Oh. How did that girl on the video do it without it sticking to her hands? It's Witchcraft. already. Yeah, I know, right? She sacrificed a virgin to the devil. I don't know what else to tell you. Well, not only that, but like, you know how people can do uh, the. Well, you might need some more cornstarch. I thought this was not one big roll, but. It implied that it wasn't. It's enough! That's too much, actually. What if she put some corn syrup on her hands? Oh, I think corn syrup would make it worse. Cause corn yeah. Syrup oh, yeah, it's already sure. sticky. So. Oh. Do you it's need more corn starch? Need more corn starch? She does. Yeah, she has sticking to my hands. It's, pretty it's starting to blob. Hold up for a it's starting to blob and it's sticking to my fingers pretty bad. Like it's hard to get off of. There we go. There we go. Just a bit more just to be on the safe side. Well, at least it is a nice pretty orange color. It is. Do you need this? No, I'm good. Okay. Peggy's going to be cleaning cornstarch out of her kitchen for like a month. Not really. It was a joke. The cat will eat it. Oops, just snipped your hair. It didn't even make a snipping sound. It did that. You've got to learn to prank. Just have a little bit there. Oh my god. god. <gasps> that looks painful as hell. It's not. I mean, I know it's not, but it looks like it is. Come on, keep going. Oh, see, now it's starting to turn opaque. It was a minute ago. She said this. I was already starting to turn Those were like her really, exact words. Really pretty orange color, so. And then we added cornstarch to it and it went shit. <laughs> Hopefully it don't taste bad with this cornstarch. It shouldn't. I hope not. Should have got some citric acid. And now I just got to make sure that the cornstarch is actually blended into it the right way. Yeah, that you don't get a big mouthful of cornstarch. Oh, God. I'm trying to keep it from sticking to my hand. The woman that made this video was a witch. on how to um, do this she had to really have should have explained how she um, got it to not stick to her hands. I know I'm not supposed to do this, but <laughs> we don't care. I'm trying to get it mixed in the best I can to where it's actually. Um, now, if you roll it into a ball and keep it that way, you have something to lick on occasion. <laughs> Oh my god, adult Laffy Taffy. I just had a great idea. No, because the alcohol would burn out. No! Shape it into dicks. Oh, yeah. Shape it into dicks. <laughs> Make pee pee taffy. There you go. Ah, no. 
I would like to make peepee taffy if it did not stick to my thumb. I think that's that Taffy's way of saying no, do not shake me into a penis, I beg of you. <laughs> not in my Christian household. <laughs> I think it's. I am cutting parchment paper. I think it's good. Uh, keep going. No, really, it is. No, seriously, keep going. You're not done yet. Slave driver. Yep. The cat wants a piece of parchment paper. The kids. This is Squeaks, by the way. This is my cat that doesn't know how to meow, but only meows when she gets a bath. When I have to give her a flea bath, where she is a long haired cat, it is hard to get a lot of fleas out of her. So we give her a flea bath, and the only time she meows is when she gets out of the tub. And, like, is scared for her life because she knows that she has to have a flea comb taken to her fur. Because with long haired cats, obviously, you have to have a flea comb in order to get all the fleas out because fleas don't just wash away. I have no idea if I'm cutting this the right size, so I am guessing, and hopefully, Tabby don't screw it up. You mean you? No, not you. Me. Not me. Yeah. My show, I can't screw anything up. Yeah, you can. No, I can't. Yeah, you can. You seen my other video? No, I have not. Why are you not watching my other video? Now, see, look what you did. I told you, you gotta lie to him. <laughs> you gotta lie through your tooth to him. I gotta lie through my bucky teeth. And we're back. She's doing something very sexual with this taffy here. Oh, I'm not meaning to. I'm trying to get it to, like, kind of stretch by itself without sticking to me. Oh, yeah. That's definitely doing stuff. That's doing stuff and things. Oh, no, don't stick to the Thank you. Oh, hey, this works a heck of a lot better. Chris, look at her technique. Look at this. It is working Look at the so boober much. on that thing. It is working so much better because now I can just roll it in my hand and be like, hey, stretch yourself. <coughs> Look, it, it's working. You already started, uh, I've, I, have, I have never seen Taffy with a set of balls on it until just now. <laughs> <laughs> you already started wrapping it? Not I, yet. I'm having that too much sound, fun. That sound. I am having way too much fun with this. And it didn't work, did it? Oh, 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 it's it's flopping in weird ways. <laughs> it's now flopping in weird ways. Roll it up, let's get ready. Start wrapping. This, this video took a turn, let me tell you what. <laughs> it took a turn for the better because now it's not sticking to my hands and I can actually get it stretched out the right way. See, look at that magic, man. It's just... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Roll it out and let's cut it up. Man. You're having too much fun. Seriously. It's good. As the director, I approve. As the one that's doing the taffy, hey, I want to stretch it a little bit more. I think it needs more stretching. It could always be bigger. <laughs> it can always be stretched out nicely. Come no, on. we got it. Come on. But it's not sticking to me now. Look I know when it's not sticking to, to oh, Now it's not. Here. Chris, did you wash your hands? Yes. Yeah. I, yeah, I did before you. Okay. Yeah. You know what I am going to do a couple pulls myself just for the head. Ooh. Now it's sticking to me. Yeah. I'll Look, Chris, you've me. ruined it. You, It's ruined. It liked me. Look how pretty I made it look. Look how good you made it feel. <laughs> it looked so nice. And now it's just like, Chris got a hair to me. I don't want to be stretching now. I just want to stick to his fingers. You want to come over and stretch this out first cut it up? She just got it off of her hands. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go ahead and stretch a little bit. No, I mean, we need to stretch it out into the Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna stretch it out. Do we need to put parchment paper down over this to stretch it out? No. That way we don't get it covered in... We're, what we want to do is we want to get it down to about... Strands down to about yay big. Tabby. About yay big. Maybe Move your hands so the camera can see. <laughs> oh! Your floors are clean, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm still gonna eat this. This is too much work. <laughs> I'm sitting here watching it just say something. Slowly say something. I'm getting Hell no! I ain't saying a damn thing. This is your project. Like I'm I don't care if it hit the floor at this point. <laughs> See if I can get it stretched out enough. Okay, so um, bite-sized pieces. Hold on, I, I haven't got the paper cut yet. 
<laughs> Here's one. Go ahead. I'll just go ahead and uh Here, I'll start cutting the paper. <laughs> Look at these two, a couple of Susie homemakers. There you go. I'm so proud. You can do a little bit bigger than that. Oh, your battery's low. Flash is unavailable, so there's... I need to come over here before I can ah, get... Can you stop dropping food in the floor? You... <laughs> you learn! Here, actually, fold that back in. <laughs> Just because it is too small. You know what? I'm going to get my knife. Where did my knife go? Where did it? Okay. If that's too small, then... Look, it's a snake. It's a snicky, snicky snake. That's a dildo, but that's a snake. I thought I was going to get stabbed for a second. What are you hand me that? What? That parchment paper I just dropped. Where? Oh, wow, that went. <laughs> that got some distance on it. Here you go. Yeah, about like that. And then put it in a piece of parchment paper and wrap it up. I'll cut the parchment paper and you cut <laughs> You cut what? The taffy. Tabby will cut the taffy. I like that. Tabby's a taffy cutter. No, I'm not. And we're back. Ah. It's better than being a window licker. Oh, well, yeah. If anyone knows what a window licker actually is and knows that it's not something sexual and perverted, he didn't until I explained it to him. I did. What is it? I'm not doing that on my channel. You're not doing what? Okay, this one just looks like a... Okay, well, it didn't come out that way. I'm just going to pull this apart because it seems to work a little bit better. So, the salt part, does it come from your hands? Is that why it's called saltwater taffy? It's actually called saltwater taffy because of where it was made. It doesn't actually have salt water in it. As much as it's touched the hands of people, it's got salt. You put salt in it. Yeah. Actually, yeah, we did put both salt and water, but mm -hmm. we did not technically put salt water in it. But didn't it become salt water by adding both salt and water? Technically. If you want it, yeah, actually, if you want to no. put it that way, it really did. So, you want to try it again? No, it's actually called salt water taffy just because of where it was made, seriously. Okay, this is not that so It is for me. <laughs> you know, we could make a good living doing this. Just make taffy and sell it. You know, I'm pretty sure nobody would <laughs> buy my taffy. Look, yeah, especially after you drop it in the floor. And All right, if I don't drop it in the floor, anybody wants to buy it, message me. I will make a batch, have Tabby personally kiss every bit, and sell it. I do not approve. Yes, she does. Do not. I am not under any kind of contract or oath. I'll give you a quarter of baseball. It's not enough. My kisses are worth more than. <laughs> no, they're not. Yeah, they are. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. Chris, you don't. Not what I've been told. <laughs> <laughs> wow, she just made herself sound like a prostitute on my channel. Hey, we are not cheap prostitutes. We are expensive prostitutes. My kisses are worth more than a quarter. How much are they worth? Five thousand dollars. How is that? I just said so. See. Hmm. Okay. Fan uh, yeah, Family I'm friendly. $5,000 for one kiss of Rooney. How about 5,000 yen? Yen. Yeah. Look at you. How much is that in American dollars? Jim's going to taste test the candy since he's the only one impartial for us. Jim is also playing Minecraft. And, okay. Awesome. We don't have much space left on the phone, so we're going to do this, and then we've got one last thing to do really quick. Be brutally honest. Be brutally oh, honest. People definitely be able to chew it. Pretty good. From one to ten, how good is it? Three. A four. <laughs> you asked for honesty. I'm thinking like at least a seven. Here, I was thinking Beck. at least a seven. I, I, I love it. it. Beck hasn't tried it. Me and Tabby were snacking as we went. And I'll be honest. That's good. Well, we're going to make more. I mean, well, and we can do now. other flavors. When we get more flavor. I'll, I'll be honest with it. I don't care if it hurts. I am four. Well, I'll give it. What? All right, he's saying six now. Beck. I made it. We made it. Well, no, she made it. Hell, I ain't. 
Here. Back. <laughs> he said six. Flavors, it's not all a bunch of mm -hmm. And it stretches like it should. Uh, yeah. Well, it didn't kill my teeth, so that I already gave points. Quick, I'm low on space. Oh, it's 8 by 7. Oh, 7. Sorry. Good it's deal. Good deal. Do what? Mm -hmm. Alright, egg cream. Simple. We're doing this the cheap happy. way because, in the good way, we would have made homemade chocolate syrup. I just used the store bought stuff since we spent so much on the. Uh, Everything. So we're going to do, this is ice cold milk that's been in the freezer. Can I have a sip of that actually? Not yet. <laughs> <coughs> nope. It's a tad bit chunky because it's frozen. We like our milk chunky. As long as, as, as long as because it is frozen and not because it's, you know, cottage cheese. Right. <laughs> so we're doing about three quarters of the way with... Ew. Oh, that was a big old chunk. <laughs> Again, that's ice. Hi. Hope. Uh, the, okay, let's say like straws or spoons or something. And that has been in the freezer, so it is good in ice cold. Do something with that. Ooh. Next. It so is unflavored, water. yes. Shit. Nah, it's unflavored. Show the oh, camera. Show detection. the camera, please. Give it a good shake. Shake. Give it a good shake. Give it a shake over Rooney. Open the damn thing. Thank there you. There we go. I uh, know a little bit about the history behind egg cream. In that it was made in New York. Why is it called oh, was egg cow. cream though? Like it's not know. even an egg. It's, a, it's milk with chocolate. Uh, you know what I mean? And then, let me see uh, straws. So what we want to do is stir it and get a little bit of a fizz going. I want the blue one. That's why I got two of them, because I'm a blue person too. If there is no purple, I want the blue. Or red. It's my favorite color too. So. That's why I got a red and a green. I see my favorite color is red, but. Now, see, normally this would be like more frothy. Yeah, I think it's where the uh, seltzer wasn't cold. And I think we may have got the milk a little too cold. This is caffeine and sodium free. Yep, it's supposed to be. The salt found it. I was wondering why it's right. on the back of the toilet. I'm like, what the hell is that? And this is our first attempt at egg cream, so I'm not sure how well this is going to work. I think we got it a little. I saw that. Stir that. Wouldn't a spoon be beneficial to stir it to get more of a frothiness? He handed me a spoon, and I did not take advantage. I think where we used the cheap seltzer water too. It's got a little frothy. Chris, knock her ball back there to her. Oh wait, no, never mind. She'll get it around you. She You're acts better like a than dog. me. I'll just... She acts like a dog. Yeah, see, it's got a little bit of a head on it. Give me the spoon. Say. Give me a spoon. <laughs> because fuck straws. This one where it's set for a minute, right there. It's got that head on it. That's what we're looking for. Mm -hmm. Can you grab that straw? It's, it's stabbing me. It's playing the evil game of let's stab the person stirring the milk. Oh, oh, sorry. Alright, let's try it out, guys. We want to torch the glass. Very quick. Oh, I was going to get Chris to do that. I'll take the little one. Alright, try it out back here. Let me record you. 
It could use more chocolate. Put a little more chocolate in it. That's the only thing I can say. It, just, it could use more chocolate. Because I see what you're trying to do here. Yeah, definitely drop some chocolate, some more chocolate in these. Alright, Tabby, stir it up and you try next. Is it good? Yeah, it's good. It just definitely really needed chocolate. Definitely needed more chocolate. Oh, Jesus. And this is why I need longer spoons. Oh, uh, yeah. Sorry, this one over here. I'll take this other one over to Jim. Tabby, taste. Yeah. That was the only thing. It really needed more chocolate. Good? Yeah, that is actually pretty good. I had never well, tried this stuff before. I haven't either, so this will be a virgin experience for me. It's been a long time since I've had a virgin experience. There we go. Right. Let us know if yours needs more chocolate. Mine did. Yeah, Give it a try and see what you think. Uh, Tabby said you're the picky one, so if you like it, then. <laughs> That's got a good taste to it. Good? I guess I gotta try it now. Somebody record me while I do. I take the. One of you! And no, I'm not doing a nude scene right now. That'll be uploaded later. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. It's chocolate milk, but it's got like the like the frothiness of like a cola. It does. Like a fountain drink. And it's really good with the like the, the pinch of, you know, the seltzer. But it's one of those you need to drink quick. Yes. It tastes like what I would imagine like an old school, like 1800s fountain drink to be like. But anyway, guys, um, I'll do an outro here and we will be done with the. 1800s. No! Yes! The old soda fountains? In the 1800s? Yes! 1860s or 1870s is when soda fountains first came out back. What's going on guys? Uh, you can tell I look like hell right now. <laughs> and Sissy is acting like hell. But she's here to help me for just a second. Uh, as we were going back editing the video of the egg cream and the taffy that you just guys... <laughs> that you guys just got done watching. Thank you Sissy. She, she was my assistant editor today. Um, we realized we lost the video of the tasting of the egg cream. Um, it actually turned out pretty good. Everybody enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, we're just going to kind of leave it at that. Um, hope you guys liked the video. Of course, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, and if you want to see more of Sissy, comment below. Uh, I'll bring her into another video later. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for checking out my latest video. If you like what you see, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that little bell so you get the latest notifications of every time I post a new video. Also, check out the links below. There might be some interesting stuff. You want to see me live? Could be. You want to help support the channel and get new content? Could be. You never know. I'm updating it often. Probably more often than this video. Just go subscribe, like, now, and click the links. We can make a wildfire get away.